Welcome. In this week, we're going to be talking about the blues, and the essay for this week is going to be a two-part essay. Okay, there are going to be two videos listed in Canvas. One is Bessie Smith's Empty Bed Blues. The second is Traveling Blues, sung by Blind William McNeil. And what I want you folks to do is write um, a paragraph on each of these uh, pieces. Okay. So the first one, um, Empty Bed Blues, watch the actual video, okay? And maybe you take notes with it, you know, have like a pad or so forth. And then you want to answer the three questions here. You know, why might this song be considered controversial uh, to the public back in the 20s? Because it was, you know. Um, and then what kind of metaphors or innuendos are being used in the text? Okay, you know, are there any are there any maybe sexual innuendos um, in this text? Okay, and and, and how does uh, how does Bessie Smith reference those? Okay, and then one other feature of this you want to talk about is how does the trompone in this piece um, how does it add to the work? You know, and do it in your own words. Okay, now that's going to be one paragraph. The next video is a separate paragraph. Okay. And we want to watch the video, uh, Traveling Blues, it's sung by Blind William McNeil. And we want to know, uh, what are the lyrics about in Traveling Blues, okay? And then, how would you describe uh, McNeil's singing style, you know? Is it gruff? Is it very lyrical, you know? And how does that enhance the, how does that enhance the song, okay? And then one other thing, how does McNeil, he's playing the guitar, how does his, the way he plays the guitar influence the lyrics and the material of the song, okay? So that's the essay for this week. Now let's keep in mind, all the information for this essay is based in these two videos. So I, we don't need to Google who Bessie Smith is or Blind Willie McNeil. I don't need a biography about these uh, folks. I don't need to hear about you know the, their lifestyle or their career. All I want to do is have this paper be focused right on these two pieces. Um, again, it's 500 words. I would do maybe like 250 words. It's more than enough for each uh, video. That's don't use AI. Um, again, I want to hear it in your own voice. And if you have any questions, uh, reach out with, with an email for me. Uh, thank you very much, and I look forward to reading your papers.